I'm Scott Rodman. I'm here to tell you about my favorite project. It's called Challenge Date, and often referred to simply as an anti-bullying workshop. It's actually a lot more. It will be on October 16, 17, 18, and 19, four days in a row at Fond du Lac High School. It's led by two highly trained and sympathetic facilitators from California. Each day, 100 freshman students go into the small gym for the whole day. As you can see, the volunteers form two rows with the students trapped in between, looking bewildered and wondering what the heck is going on here anyway? What are all these old people doing here? Soon the icebreakers begin and the kids settle into the serious work at hand. The students interact with 30 adult volunteers and that's why I'm talking to you now. To learn more about being a volunteer, join us at Selma Storytelling on Friday, August 18th at 11 a.m. See it in the background here, right? You can't miss it. As a volunteer, you'll participate hand in hand with the students in icebreakers and conversations about the problems many students experience day by day, typically caused by isolation and loneliness. Students wondering, how do I fit in? How can I make and keep friends? Why are some students so mean? It's a very intensive program with outstanding results. At the end of the day, many students conclude by saying simply, I'm not alone. And some even say that it was the best day of my life. When I was in Challenge Day, I believe I had one of the best outcomes that Challenge Day could have. What happened was back in, high, in middle school, I was actually picked on quite often for my sexuality and my nationality. At the end of Challenge Day, there was an event that it was called like an open mic and you could come in and apologize to anybody that was either in the room. And one of the person that would pick on me in middle school actually came up and he apologized to me about everything that he had done. Um, and to me, that was very emotional and I never knew that this would happen. And one of the best things was that um, not only did he apologize that day, but throughout my whole high school career, he was still my friend and he was somebody that supported me throughout those years. On August 18th, you will hear directly from young people who have been through Challenge Day. As a volunteer, you are essential to the success of the program by guiding students as they learn how to deal with the trials and tribulations of being in school.